see what happens. I'm amazed myself. I really did not think that was going to start. But it's absolutely spot on. That time was spot on. Everything's spot on. This is a Jaguar based Ronart kit car. It's fitted with a V12 6 litre Jaguar engine. I'm going to show you what I've done with some 80 throttle bodies. So we're going to lift up the, uh, the bonnet and have a look. Okay, so this is the engine that I've completely rebuilt and it's a copperized version of the V12 Jaguar engine. The reason I did this was I wanted to expose parts of the engine that you wouldn't normally see with the standard Jaguar V12 attachments. So these are the 80 throttle bodies here which I've utilized and you can see that they bolted very nicely to the actual inlet manifolds which I've made down below. I will just zoom in there but you can see that these um, actual copper bits here are inch and three eight sockets from a refrigeration system that I've adapted to actually fit on to the 80 throttle body. Now you can see the 80 throttle body there. Um, it's actually uh, nicely bolted in onto the top of the inlet manifold. Um, these are spun trumpets made out of copper. Uh, this is the copper rail line, which is made out of beryllium copper. And uh, it's attached to the actual injector here, which goes into the AT throttle body. This has a little fishing swivel here. So as you turn this set screw here, it winds down the rail and pushes that nicely onto the top of the injector to make a nice seal. So there you have it, this is the V12 Jaguar engine which has got a lovely set of 80 throttle bodies here and they fitted very well. They've all been lined up exactly right and mic'd up. Um, it works very well on the throttles, they, 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 they open nicely we just have to put it through its IVA test yet to make sure that it's road legal.